Hello friends, and welcome to today's episode. A kind police officer takes a woman in labor on the street to the hospital and stays with her until she gives birth. But soon after the baby is born, he finds out something he didn't expect and ends up being the child's father. Couples who want to have children have to think about a lot of things. Nothing is better than being a parent, but we can't forget that the child also deserves to be happy. Don't we all agree on this? Unfortunately, many new parents don't, and in their happiness at having a baby, they don't think about what's coming. That's exactly what happened to a new mom named Caroline, who went into labor on a strange street. Caroline hadn't been feeling very well since the day began. She worked as a software engineer and lives in New York City with her boyfriend Jacob. When she and her boyfriend found out they were going to be parents, they were overjoyed. Caroline thought that everything was great. But everything changed one day. Officer Santos was on his way to the police station. It was a mostly sunny morning. He was in such a hurry to get to work on time that he forgot to eat breakfast. He turned his car in the direction of his favorite place to eat before going to the station. Once he got there, he got the order packed up and went back to the car, where he couldn't help but take a bite of the food. Jesus, please. The people who work here need a raise. This has to be the best bagel I've ever had, he said, wrinkling his face in satisfaction. Nobody's coming, she said in a shaky voice. You need to leave now, officer. After eating the bread, Officer Santos got back behind the wheel and chose to drink the coffee at work. He took a shortcut to the station after leaving the fast food place, but then he saw something and stopped. He asked, what's going on over there? Officer Santos saw a lot of people standing around the corner of the street, so he got out of his car and ran over to find out what was going on. As he pushed through the crowds of people to get to the curb, he saw a woman crying horribly because she was in pain. Have the ambulances come yet? She needs to get to the hospital as soon as possible. Officer Santos knew what was going on when a woman yelled, she's giving birth. The woman was having painful cramps and needed to go to the hospital right away. Officer Santos was running late for work, but when he saw how sick the woman was, he couldn't do anything else but help her. He made up his mind right away and didn't wait another second. He didn't want to wait for the ambulance, so he took the woman in his car and asked for help. Pick her up and bring her to my car. He said, I know a shorter way to get to the city hospital, and a few people jumped in to help him. Together, they lifted the woman and carried her safely to Officer Santos' car. Officer Santos then took the woman to the hospital as quickly as he could. He told her, ma'am, you're going to be okay, while she kept screaming in pain. It won't take more than 10 minutes. Please be patient. Officer Santos drove as fast as he could, and he got to the hospital in 10 minutes, which seemed like an eternity. When he got there, he called for an orderly right away, and the woman was taken to the emergency room. So he could make sure the woman was okay, he stayed at the hospital until the woman gave birth and then called the station to say he'd be late. Officer Santos didn't move from his spot during the arrival. He waited outside the ward, and then a doctor came up to him and told him that the birth had gone well. A girl was born to the woman. The mother and child are both safe. You'll be able to see them soon, the doctor said with a smile. After the woman was moved to the general room, Officer Santos went to see her. He offered to call her family on her behalf, but as soon as he said it, she started crying. Nobody's coming, she said in a shaky voice. I don't have any family because I was left by the baby's father when I was a kid. He didn't want to be the child's father, so he left. Officer, you can go now. Thank you for all the help you gave me to get here. I can take care of the rest on my own. Officer Santos didn't know what to do next. Before he left the hospital, he brought her some food and gave her his phone number so that she could get in touch with him if she needed to. But things went in a very different and better direction. Officer Santos started going to see Caroline in the hospital every day and took care of her until she was released. You don't have to do this, officer, Caroline told him every time, and he smiled. All I'm doing is my job. Keeping people safe and helping them, ma'am. She told him, Caroline, one day. Please just call me Caroline. Officer Santos and Caroline didn't know it at first, but over time, they became very close, and soon after, they fell in love. Officer Santos enjoyed spending time with Janet, 
and he wanted to be with her and Caroline for the rest of their lives. So he did it one day. He got up the nerve, got on his knees, and asked her to marry him. I want to love and protect you and Janet until the end of my life, even if that sounds creepy. Caroline, will you get married to me and be mine for life? Caroline said no, right away, and Officer Santos's face fell. No? But I thought we were in love? Caroline started laughing out of the blue. Oh my God, your face. Of course, the answer is yes. But what if I really said no, she laughed. Jesus, please. He laughed as he put the ring on her finger. You scared the hell out of me. Then he gave her a tight hug and told her he would always be there for her. This made Caroline blush. I'm in love with you. She told him, I couldn't have found a better partner. The sweet couple got married a month later, and as Officer Santos had promised Caroline, he became a wonderful husband and a much more caring father. He loves his family more than anything else, and it all happened because of a miracle that was completely out of the blue. That's it for today friends. Please let us know what you think about this story. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you soon for more amazing stories.